one. That's and right. when God made you, when God made you, pay respect to God. Mm -hmm. And when God take care of you, because nobody don't take care of you but God. And God always going to look out for you. Mm -hmm. So I'm telling you now, God help my sister. She need that brain out. She need to get the, your powerful pain inside her and make that devil go away. And when that devil go away, he going to show you what he got to see. And when God comes to you, he put his powerful stuff in you, you going to might aim. Because that stuff hurt. And the devil, he going to get hurt too. Don't worry about that devil. Because when it rain and thunderstorm, that's what God and the whole church get rain on. But inside it, inside the church, is God. So if you go to a church, God is there for you. And if you don't go to church, the devil is there for you. And if you take up for the devil, God going to show you his powerful and everything. He going to show you how the devil get beat up by you get beat up. Since you want to be the devil, that's on you. You want to just have to be powerful. Brain, your brain, your stomach is all that's gone. That's how powerful he is. And when he get that anger inside your heart, it's gonna hurt. And if the, if the rain come, and God make a little thunderstorm come down to you, you gonna die. And then when you die, you are gonna go straight down to the devil because God ain't gonna let you come. So, with God taking care of you, he better take care of you. Because if he don't take care of you, ain't nothing gonna happen. And if the devil come and take care of you, take care of mother. Huh? Take care of mother. And your mother, God, that's your mother, actually, your mother is not your real mother. For real. God right in your real mother. Real, real mother. Even my Aunt Johnny recorded me. And that's her real mother. Grandma, the dead people, all them. Barack Obama, all that. The president. So when God takes care of you, he takes care of you. And when the devil takes care of you, God going to get the power for you. And I'm going to show you how to go to church. I'm going to show you how to read the Bible. And I'm going to show you what God's power for is. Because he did it to me when I was the devil one day. Mm -hmm. And guess what? And I'm going to ask, I ain't going to be no devil no more. And because he showed me all his power for inside him. Mm -hmm. And I, I almost got hurt. And when I get hurt, that's what I die. So when God put the power on you, you let him get the power. And if the devil come and talk to you, and all that stuff just crash down, and it's a ghost of him, like the devil, he say, ooh, that's the devil. If a devil, like God, God's not a devil at all, at all. He's a nice person to you, and he that one that take it. Barack Obama, the music people, Aunt Johnny, Uncle Gary, Richie, Grandma, all of them that take care of you, and that's and you gonna have respect to them because all of them is God. So. Go with him.
I'm going to tell you, I'm saying, Johnny, on Sundays, can you take me and ladies to church? And I'm going to show you how God powerful is inside the church. And they'll talk in that. And if you raise your hand and just whatever, the speech, man, he going to tell you about God inside his heart. And, like, when you go to church and read the Bible, that's when God comes inside. Mm -hmm. So, when you sit down, and man, you have a conversation, that's when, when I tell you about God, that's what God going to do. God going to respect me, all his things for me, and everything. Buy me clothes. See, look, God made this for me. Made Barack Obama, all that. He made even the football team. So when you, when me and you tell me talk, I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to say, God powerful. That means he's bad. I mean, that means he's like real angry. And he want to defeat that devil. And when God can't defeat that devil, <laughs> all his kids, grown, all the grown-ups' kids, that's his kids. And we all going to go up there and defeat that devil. And if we can't go up there, God going to lift his hand down and bring us up there. And God is for real. God is up in the sky. And he is real. And he is a person. But he is a giant and a big. Just like the devil. But I'm not going to say nothing about the devil. Because he's a stranger of God. And if God comes all the way down to our ground, like the floor, the buildings, he come down, he's so mad, and he gonna tell all us go up there with him, and yes, defeat that devil. And when we defeat that devil, we gonna win. Who gonna win? Us. God, so I mean, your mind would just get inside God's heart, because if you don't, by the time at 10 o'clock, 12 on him, or at dark time when you sleep, he going to come in your sleep and he going to defeat you. And when he defeats you, he going to get mad. Then he going to strangle you. He going to strangle you. He going to get you, bring you up there, and he going to let you go to the devil. And you and the devil is going to get down. So I'm telling you now, I'm trying to tell you. Because he did all that things to me. He picked me up. He brought me up there. I saw the devil. The devil was so powerful. He couldn't even defeat God. Because God was powerful to him. And he defeat me. And that devil. The devil gone away crying. And that's what I did. I was on the floor day. And he made me back true. Because... I don't want that said I was in his life and I was going to be him. So that's why I'm down here for my family and my family is going to take up for me. So I have to really have respect to my family. Even my aunt, my, all my family, my aunt Joni, Grandma, my mother, my father, my brother, my cousin, my other cousin, my aunt, all of them. My uncle. So you ready to respect to God and your family? Because if you don't, I'm through with it. I'm going to let God destroy you because I ain't going to take up for you, the devil. 
God said, don't do nothing to you. He said, the